Okay, guys, here I come again. Uh, today we are talking about um, turning on our TV with our laptop batteries, with our 18650 batteries. That is where the power wall comes in. Now you will believe that you, you can have a battery for your house. Especially for RVs, for those who have RVs. You can build up a pack like this so you don't have to go around with a generator. Just charge up the packs and you put it on the car and you go. So you can power up your RV without thinking about gasoline polluting the world with what the world do not need. At this particular time, I'll be showing you what this brick can do. Here I have a power converter. A power converter with 410 watt. Here is the positive of the battery, so I put it on, and here comes the negative part of it. You see a spark, that's normal, but don't have to continue if you continue. If the spark continues, it means there's a problem. Okay, now that we have put on, we have connected our power converter. Let's turn it on and see if it turns on. The green, it turns on. Now, what I will do is, this is the power cable, the power supply cable to my TV right here. What I will do is, I will connect to my TV. The beep from the power inverter. Right now, the light on my TV is on, so I'm just going to turn on this TV. Just give me a minute, let me get the remote. Okay, now that you see that the cable is connected there, let's turn it on. And the power inverter may start making noise, may start drawing power from the battery pack. Let me turn on my own channel, my so we can take a look and actually see. You see? It pops up. As you can see guys, my TV is turning on with the... My TV is turning on with my battery pack here. So what does that mean? If you have couple packs like this one, you can actually power your RVs, power your house with this pack. I'm thinking that with this pack, I can actually power this TV. I had a bigger pack before that I tried it. It powered my TV for more than 36 hours. But this pack, I think it can actually power my TV for... Oh, let me see, about 6 hours. Just turning on, watch the TV at night, turn it off. Let's see. Let me show you, this is my... Uh, you see, this is my YouTube channel. For those of you who have not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and you'll keep seeing these videos. Let's see one more thing that this thing can do. As you see guys, this is, this is the power inverter that I'm using. And you see it is connected to the battery, to the battery pack. Okay. Just to be to make sure this guys this cable is connected to my TV. That's just for those of you who do not believe. Okay, let me now let me try something. Let Let's try and turn off the inverter to see if my remote is here. So let me turn off this inverter to see if the TV will turn off. You see that? It turns off. And if I turn it on back, the inverter start, the TV come back on. I see that. 